And you are listening to KZSC Santa Cruz. Welcome back to the Seduction Hour with Dan Davis. As per usual, I'm your host, Dan Davis. Occasionally that changes. Tonight, however, no, you are stuck with me. But once again, it's really nice to have you here and stuff. KZSC is a clusterfuck of people that uh, has come together to make one of the strongest community radio stations, college radio stations in the nation, I think. Um, it's, it's, it's really a wonderful place. The, the big thing about KZSC is that we're a real center of community. I'm the broadcast advisor at KZSC Radio, the radio station on the campus of the UC Santa Cruz. The broadcast advisor serves a role very much like an umpire at a baseball game. We facilitate the game being played, but don't play ourselves. Oliver, how are you? Good. I would define KZSC by its people. It's a fun place. It's a community, dare I say. It's, it's the student voices that people hear, mistakes and all, that make us a unique sounding station and make our, our, our place in the community radio dial uh, something special. My name is Allison O'Connor Korb. I am the Intro to Radio instructor, and I do the show Once Upon a Time. Oh, God. Um, how would I describe KZSC? All right. I want you to imagine, like, summer camp. Little log cabin hidden in the woods all out there. Fill it with, like, simultaneously the craziest, most interesting, and just utterly bizarre individuals you could possibly imagine and sort of give them infinite power over the airwaves. KCSC, it's a lot of fun in any kind of music. All the people who come and contribute, everybody's got their special flavor. So KCSC is like this great, huge, delicious soup of any kind of music and all sorts of people playing. It's the alternative to commercial or corporate radio. I think that's the most clear-cut way of looking at it. Um, not commercially sponsored, no kind of vested interest other than the people who put it together. When someone tunes in, especially in this day and age where everyone has the access to the internet and finding essentially any track that they want. They have CDs, they have MP3s, they have everything to get them that instant satisfaction. The act of people tuning in um, is a compliance to engage with something unknown, to listen to new material and come away with something more. It's really a biz I mean, I love everyone at KZSC, which is surprising as I'm a person who's filled with hatred. But I love everyone at KZSC, but it's simultaneously this really bizarre experience. We all are a bunch of people who love music, sometimes a little bit too much, sometimes a little bit too ferociously, and we all have our different interests, but we can all come together in this freaky little place and express ourselves and get along. It seems sort of utopian, but it works. I love KZSC. The, the local community has voted us their favorite radio station year after year in many local newspapers. So we can tell that if we're serving our students and we're serving our campus, that other people are enjoy enjoying what we're doing as well. It's because we're a community radio that we can have an outreach beyond just the student body and be able to give something and um, provide an opportunity for people to come and find a new way to express themselves. I'm not very much of a musical person, I'm not very artistic, but what I can do is I can order songs in a way that I think conveys a good message or, you know, can at least get people dancing. Um, I see us just continuing to have a good time. The students that cycle through and their good fresh ideas, community members, music they love too. No, radio will never die. Whether you want it or not, radio is sort of like a cockroach or Keith Richards. It will never, ever die. And I think that KZSC, because we do surprisingly well for a college radio station, much less a non-commercial radio station, and the fact that we have a purpose serving the community and we use the airwaves, which are allotted to us, KZSC is probably going to last for a very long time. 
as long as we can keep fundraising and um, kind of keep a community presence and a campus presence as well, um, I think KZSC is going to do just fine. KZSC would like to thank everyone for doing what you're doing right now, listening. The Great 88 has been listed as the most listened to college radio station by the website radiolocator.com. Whether you're listening online, in your car, or anywhere else, everyone at KZSC appreciates your support.